Hello, and thanks for logging on to Channel6NewsOnline.com. I'm Eric Hanschuker here at the Prudential Center. After the Kentucky Wildcats were able to upset the University of North Carolina Tar Heels in an exciting game where the fans were off their feet for all 40 minutes. Kentucky now advances to the Final Four in Houston, and the University of North Carolina Tar Heels have to go home and finish their season. Feel to be going to the Final Four. It was great for a freshman in my first year here. Feel great to go to the Final Four, and I know back home's crazy, so we just can't wait to get back. Last Friday, you guys beat Ohio State to one seed, and now tonight you guys beat UNC at the two seed. What makes you guys think that you guys are going to be able to beat UConn at the three seed? Well, we're just doing what we're doing right now: is playing defense, coming together, and just um, running offense. Thank you. How were you guys able to guard up against Harris and Barnes? Well, Harrison Barnes um, came out slow a little bit. Then he got a couple fast break points and got a little couple of ones though. But we know we know he's a great player though. But it don't really matter about all the points he scored. We won the game, so it don't really matter about that. This is what Darius Miller had to say after winning the Elite Eight game, advancing to the Final Four. The whole nation doubted you in your past two games against teams that had a better ranking than you. How does it feel now to prove the nation wrong and be in the Final Four? Um, it feels great. Um, like you said, nobody thought we can do it, and that makes it feel even that much better. Um, we did a great job of fighting through a lot of tough games throughout the tournament, and um, hopefully we can continue the run. You guys, you guys have been going all over the nation all throughout the basketball season. Your last stop is Houston. What makes you guys think that you guys could come out there as champions? Um, we're, we're confident in our in our team. I mean, uh, we've been rolling. We, we've got a hot team right now, so hopefully we can just keep the streak going. You guys have been in this whole tournament, you guys have been beating teams that beat you in the regular season. What makes you guys think that you guys can beat UConn? Um, really just trying to stop um, them as a team, really, hopefully. I mean, they're a great team, and they beat us by a good margin. So hopefully we'll be able to play better than what we did in Maui. How did it feel when you guys came into the locker room and Jay-Z was there? Um, it was great. I mean, that just added on to the experience of just winning the Elite Eight and going on to the Final Four. It was just a great experience and just a great feeling. Thank you for your time. Brandon, how does it feel as a freshman to be able to lead your team all the way to the Final Four? Uh, it means a lot, uh, but it's not just me. Um, you know, it's, it's, it's all of our guys coming together to, uh, you know, win, win, make it to the Final Four. Final games at the Prudential Center have finally concluded tonight where the UNC Tar Heels lost to Kentucky. Now the UNC Tar Heels go home and finish off their season, but Kentucky isn't over yet and they still have to play two more games at Houston. Obviously they are happy today, but this isn't their final goal. They still have two more games there. If they want to be champions, they are going to have to step up and win those games. For Channel 6 News, I'm Eric Hansugar.